you can install WooCommerce on your WordPress site just like any other plugin. We will walk you through the process. On your WordPress dashboard, go to Plugins, and click Add New. Type in the search field and find WooCommerce. Click Install Now. Once the plugin is installed, the Install Now button changes to Activate. Click the Activate button to enable WooCommerce. Now you can see WooCommerce in the list of installed plugin. Also, on the dashboard, you can see WooCommerce and different settings related to it. WooCommerce has detailed settings for multiple aspects of your store. Click WooCommerce on your WordPress admin panel, then click Help. Go to Setup Wizard click the Setup Wizard button to do a quick setting up of your store configurations. On the Setup Wizard, first you have to configure your store setup. Enter the base address of your store with country, city, and zip code. Here you can specify the currency that you want to use. Finally, choose what type of products you want to sell. You can choose to sell either digital or physical products, or both. If you are planning to sell products or services in person, you can tick the checkbox at the bottom. Next, you can set up the payment options. You can opt for both online and offline payment options here and any additional options can always be installed later. The available online choices on the setup wizard are Stripe and PayPal. You can also choose offline options such as check payments, bank transfer, and cash on delivery also here. Moving on to shipping you can set up three different shipping options, live rates, flat rate, and free shipping. WooCommerce provides accurate USPS rates using WooCommerce services and Jetpack. You can switch this on from the setup wizard, or choose to enable later. Here, you can also choose weight unit to calculate shipping rates, and dimension unit for accurate package selection. Next option is to automate tax calculations on your site. If toggled on, WooCommerce services and Jetpack will be installed and activated. You can choose to enable it or skip and go to the next step. WooCommerce also encourages to install Jetpack, which will help you with store monitoring, statistics, and security. You can either toggle it on, or skip and go to the next step. With that, the primary configuration of your WooCommerce store is complete. Here the setup wizard suggests possible next steps that you can do. You can choose to join the WooCommerce email list to get tips, product updates, etc. Or, go to product settings and create your first product. And if you have a set of existing products on your site, you can import them from a CSV file. You can also go through the guided tour videos and other details on the WooCommerce site. Clicking on the bottom link will take you back to your WordPress admin dashboard. After the setup wizard is run, you can see that some WooCommerce specific pages are created on your site. On the WordPress admin panel, go to pages, and click all pages to see cart, checkout, my account, and shop pages already created. You are ready with a basic configuration of WooCommerce now. The detailed settings will be discussed in the next videos.